I'm Rancho Palos Verdes City Manager Aram Ranyan with an update from the October 3rd City Council meeting. The City Council considered the pros and cons of declaring a local emergency and a building moratorium within the Portuguese Bend landslide complex. After receiving community input, the Council voted to declare a local emergency and approved an interim urgency ordinance to prohibit new construction in the landslide complex comprised of Portuguese Bend, Abalone Cove, and Klondike Canyon. These steps will provide the city with more tools to seek state and federal assistance and to coordinate with the city's two landslide abatement districts. Over the past few years, accelerated movement in the landslide area has caused an increase in water and gas line leaks, which have impacted the Portuguese Bend, Abalone Cove, and Seaview neighborhoods, where two homes were recently red tagged. The City Council and staff are continuously working with residents, utilities, and government agencies on long-term solutions to stabilize the slide. The public can now log onto the City's website to track the latest landslide movement by going to rpvca.gov forward slash land movement. Meanwhile, the City Council moved forward on improving traffic calming measures for Avenida Classica and Avenida Esplendida between Crest Road and Las Verdes Drive. Those measures include installing traffic circles at the intersections of Avenida Classica and Avenida Esplendida, and to explore the option of installing a traffic light at Hawthorne Boulevard and Las Verdes Drive. Over the past few years, residents living near the Las Verdes Golf Course have raised concerns about speeding and cut through traffic prompting the City's Traffic Safety Committee, staff and the Council to investigate and take action and the City Council continued to take action to monitor power outage issues in the Grandview Estates neighborhood. The Council received a progress report from staff regarding Southern California Edison's ongoing efforts and timeline to resolve power grid problems in Grandview Estates. Edison officials are expected to present another update at the October 17th City Council meeting. For more information on all the issues before the City Council, watch the October 3rd meeting on RPV TV or the City's website at rpvca.gov. Let's stay connected and remember, we are RPV together.